Wi-Fi players, AJ here. Just a quick video to talk about AirPod Pros. Okay, so looked online today on Amazon UK um, and they're selling Amazon Pros for $179.99. Go on to Curry's here in the UK and they're $179.99. Now Curry's have always kept them about 215, 220 pounds. Um, but for them to come in to level, get permission, I suppose, from Apple to now bring them down in price um, is not unusual for things. But to me, that says that AirPod Pros 2 will be coming out imminently in September, uh, probably the end of September um, this year, 2021. Design-wise, who knows? Um, hopefully... The casing's not any bigger than this because this is a nice small case um, to fit in your hand in any pocket, um, any tight jean pocket. Um, but they probably will be slightly bigger. I think they may be getting rid of the little stalk piece, which I think is not a good idea uh, simply because with my hands, certainly, and I've not got massive sausage fingers, but they're just easier to take out. I think if you get something like what Samsung's got and other brands that are out there, um, Bose and all those, um, you know, without that, they can be quite tricky to get out. And if you haven't got perfectly fitted ears for that sort of thing, then, you know, you're going to struggle to get them out. So I would say um, to keep the stalks. But if they don't, then... One second. Um, if they don't, then hey-ho, um, you know, that's good to keep the stalks. But um, maybe battery life as well, capability of fast charging. So when you put it down on a Quee charger, um, that it charges it much faster. Um, say maybe full charge in 20 minutes. That's the case as well as the, the pods themselves. Um, also, I think, you know, I looked on the Apple Store itself directly and they were still 24999, so 250 pounds. So they're not budging, but they're allowing other companies to lower that price. Um, and, and on Amazon, it is the Apple Store. So you'll sort of click on the link, it takes you to the Apple Store, and it says there. But when you look at it, before you click on it, it says AirPod Pros 2. So is that some sort of hint that they're getting some new siblings coming out. I don't know. Um, but that's what I feel. I feel that they will be. But like with the new iPhones, you can now get slightly quicker charging uh, through Qi charging. And I think that these new ones will have that technology. I can't see what else they could actually add as in sound quality wise, because you've already got, you know, perfect sound quality now coming out, um, which certainly does eat through my data when I'm not at home using Wi-Fi, um, you know, the broadband that I have here, it does eat through nearly my 10 gig data plan that I have a month. And um, yeah, that's something that shows you that I am streaming or downloading high quality um, music. And you notice the difference as well. The sound quality is so, so good now. You know, you've got lossless sound, you've got the stream rate, which is even higher now it's it is so different and if you like my wife she's got spotify with her spotify she's got airpod pros as well so i have compared the sound quality from the for the same song and you do notice a big big difference i mean you can do it through apple uh, music if you select a track that's not got lossless sound and and atmos and just normal sound and then you pick another track uh, from another album that has got all the new features, sound quality, you, you will notice the difference. Um, and that's really good. Um, and they've not upped the price in these. They've not said, right, we've got to up the subscription on Apple Music, you know, it's still just under £10, give or take a penny. Um, but for me, I think, you know, these are the best things out there. And now because you've got this better audio sound quality, um, when you turn up the volume now, it sounds even better. You get truer bass, truer treble, it's just all of it. The whole thing has just been 
increased and sound so much better. There's no distortion, there's nothing like that at all. So, you know, thumbs up to Apple for doing that. Um, it's not like you've got to pay a premium rate to get better features on Apple now. It, it's it's there and it's really good. Um, and yeah, that's what I like. That's what I like about Apple. They don't have like, you know, you can watch our movies like on Sky, but if you want to watch the latest ones and the greatest one, the Ultra HD, you've got to pay, you know, 20 pounds to, to have it, to watch it. Well, that's the same as going to the cinema, but you know, that's where the cinema is being crushed, not just because of the pandemic, but because of what Sky is doing. And I think Sky, you know, they talk about, you know, supporting this and supporting that, but they're not really actually taking the money from, from the cinema. Um, but anyway, enough of cinemas back to these so I think these will be coming out September as in Airport Pros 2 um, I don't think they're going to bring out any different colours I think they'll still be in the, the white colour um, which is a bit disappointing but nevertheless um, yeah Apple keep doing what you're doing just sort it out but anyway I've got another video coming up soon about the iPhone 13 and what that's going to look like or what we know far as far as we can so far of uh, new features using a local satellite system that helps you to uh, make phone calls if your signal's gone somewhere anywhere in the world smaller notch bigger batteries faster charging and i don't know but maybe a fingerprint reader under the screen maybe that's too soon anyway guys thanks for watching and i'll see you all soon Cheers. Bye-bye.